And that section on uh, that you mentioned, the different myths. The uh, number one that we, uh, you know, that people don't think we need supplementation. You also talked about if we don't get the nutrients we need, our bodies can't function optimally. And different studies, for instance, the low levels of vitamins B5, B3, and calcium are linked to to arthritis. But they've actually found, I guess, many diseases linked to deficiencies. I absolutely, after all these years of doing this work, do not think there is a disease that a major part of why that disease occurs is from nutritional deficiency, if not the total disease is from nutritional deficiency. Now, what's really interesting, before we discovered the very first supplement, a a young uh, research physician in London, England, back in 1905, called William Fletcher did that. And he discovered B1. And he was looking at that because a well-known disease, a very uh, chronic disease at that point through culture and society, was beriberi. And he was trying to find a way to resolve beriberi. That can kill you, by the way. And he found on the side of whole grain brown rice what he isolated and called B1. Now, from that point forward, Uh, Within 30 to 40 years, we discovered that this wasn't an isolated nutrient, that it was actually part of a family called the B-complex family. So there is a small example. Uh, Many diseases are 100% like beriberi deficiencies. Pellagra, another deficiency. But again, if you go to the mainstream medical community and ask what to do, it is almost 100% likely that they're going to give you an antibiotic or an anti-inflammatory that has nothing to do with fulfilling nutrients. And as a matter of fact, reduce the little bit of nutrition you have in you by wiping it out of the body. So, yeah, this is a very serious thing. Cancer. Uh, Here in the United States alone, our disease control center has stated that they think upward of 80% of all cancer is lifestyle created. Now, Guess what? I think that 98% of all heart attacks and strokes are lifestyle created. Eating the wrong things that we consider food that we fill ourselves up with and not having the right things that have nutrition in it. I don't think there is a disease, diabetes. None of these diseases are not directly related with deficiencies and overeating something that doesn't have nutrition that gives us fat, weight, etc. 